is to diacetyse sulfanilic acid and for that I have measured out 5.2 grams of sulfanilic acid. Sulfanilic acid as you can see is an off white coloured fluffy powder and it is readily soluble in water. Next we measure out 1.35 grams of anhydrous sodium carbonate. Sodium carbonate is available as soda ash or washing soda. Now we transfer the measured sulfanilic acid into a 100 ml Erlenmeyer flask. On top of that we add the anhydrous sodium carbonate which we just measured out. Into that we add 50 ml of distilled water to start the reaction. Sulfanilic acid being an acid starts reaction with the carbonate giving out carbon dioxide which you can see as the effervescence. It forms sodium salt of para amino benzene sulfonic acid. Now we heat the solution until the turbidity disappears and the solution becomes clear. When the solution is clear we set it out from the heat source for cooling. Now we measure out 1.8 grams of sodium nitrite. It is sodium nitrite NaNO2 and not nitrate. Into that add 5 ml of distilled water and mix to make a solution. This sodium nitrite solution we add into the previously boiled and cold solution of sulfanilic acid and sodium carbonate. Now we are making another solution by adding 5.25 ml of concentrated hydrochloric acid into 30 grams of crushed ice. After cooling we add that previously made solution into the cold acid solution. This completes the diacetization of sulfanilic acid and the disonium chloride then ionizes in aqueous solution to form the sodium ion, chloride ion and the internal salt.